Take a look at these leaves. That's what we call honeydew. It is absolutely disgusting. It's the feces of Chinese lantern flies and it's all over all my outdoor plants. So come along with me, Susie Q. Hey. Welcome to Planty Q 101. My name's Susie. And today I want to talk about my beautiful house plants that I keep outside. I built this nice area for these house plants to stay outside that they're not getting direct sun and they get lots of rain. They're in well-drained pots or in LECA. Some of them are in volcanic rock and they thrive out here until this year. This is a problem. You see that? It is not raining out. Let me show you. Look at this. Do you know what that is? That is honeydew. All over the bridge. It's all over my pool, pond, my plants. It is covered in honeydew. Oh my God, my house plants. Oh, it's all over the house plants. It's all over the house plants. Do you know what this is from? Let me tell you. What is honeydew? Where did it come from? Not only is it like sap-like substance, it's also creating a lot of mold. So if you live in the mid-Atlantic area, you probably have already heard about this Chinese spotted lanternfly. So invasive and so disgusting. It's an actual plant hopper. It doesn't fly, although it's got these gorgeous wings. And when I first saw it, I'm an animal lover. I like bugs. I'm not opposed to them. And when I saw this spectacular creature, I thought, why are they telling me to kill it? As soon as you see it, kill it and scrape up the remains because it can be toxic to your animals. I'm like, what is this bug? It's deja vu. This happened a couple decades ago. The same thing with the stink bug. It came over from China, landed somewhere in Pennsylvania, and has spread disgustingly, invasively throughout. Now we have the spotted Chinese lantern form. Lycoma delicatula. It's, that's the fancy name for this Chinese spotted lantern fly. Yeah, they lay their nest, it's like on the flat part of the wood. During the first three stages, they're tiny little, they look like they're small black insects with white spots. The nymph's final stage though gets very colorful with red and black stripes and white dots. And they're particularly noticeable during this period because of their bright coloration. And they reach about an inch big. And you wouldn't know that they don't fly because you see them in the air, they land on you, but they're really jumping from plant to plant, tree to tree. And what they do is they suck the sap right out of the tree and their excrement, their poop, drips down at times. You, it looks like it's raining sap. Literally right now I'm being pooped on by Chinese lantern flies. And it's all over these plants, all over these plants, which if you don't wash it off or if it doesn't rain, it could also grow mold. So this is invasive. It's disgusting. Even though the actual creature looks spectacular. If you're in the mid-Atlantic part of the United States, you probably have heard of this. If you're from China, you've heard of it. But this is an invasive species and it is spreading quickly. Let's take a look. I can see it's starting to get some mold on it and it just rained so I thought they were washed off completely what I'm gonna have to do and right now it's washable so I'm going to wash it off I'm gonna scrub each leaf first with just water all the way down to see oh look at this Sunnesia love this love this is one of my favorite plants from when I was little got my micans Growing back, this is almost dead. My ZZ plant, ah, oh yeah, there's some new growth on the ZZ plant. You know, oh, look at that, the skindapsis, except for they're covered in honeydew. If you've had this lantern fly invade your area yet, watch out. There are some ways to combat it, and I'll leave some links below to some very good channels, and I'm not an expert on them, but I love my houseplants, and I am not happy 
because they cannot get this kind of natural nourishment that they get out here in the rain and the ambient light, fresh air, everything. I, they can't get that inside my house. I think what I'm going to do for my plants is wash them off and bring them inside because I don't want this honeydew all over everything. Hey, everybody, it's Susie Q. Hey, everybody, it's Susie Q. Nah, nah, hey, everybody, it's Susie Q. So come along with me. Set off Susie Q.